Hello everyone and welcome back to my video channel. This time uh, I want to show you the inside electronics of this uh, smart switch from the brand Flamingo. I bought this device in, uh, in the Netherlands in the store Action and it costed me 20 euros and this is the device and well yeah I actually already uh, unscrewed two, uh, two of them to show you the inside electronics this is the device uh, here you have some information about this model I hope you can read it so I already um, tried it out in the uh, Wi-Fi socket and it actually uh, works very good you can just put this one in the in the power supply and then on your mobile phone you can download the application and whenever you open the application you have to press this button and pair it with your uh, Wi-Fi access point in your home and after that you can just uh, control the device from anywhere so that's uh, that's awesome but uh, there's also one more functionality that I was interested uh, in that is that this one should also work um, as a as a hub or gateway to control other um, remote really controlled devices in your home as you can see on the rear side of the production uh, package you can see that it's working on uh, Wi-Fi so this is the usual uh, frequency but they also note the 433 uh, megahertz frequency and on this frequency um, you have the cheaper controller wall controller uh, parts and I was um, curious if I uh, am able to control them too but first of it I'm gonna open the device and show you the inside of the uh, electronics and uh, let's see what kind of chips they have used to make the communication with the 4.433 megahertz uh, part so the screws are three wing and actually today I didn't have my three wing uh, screwdrivers with me so you can also use this one it's just a regular flat uh, screwdriver but if you press hard enough in inside uh, this kind of screws as you can see you have good contact you are able to turn it around and open the device so I haven't opened it yet I just removed the screws so it's a little bit easier for the video so let's see what's on the inside so this is the, you usually see this part, it's just fitted over here and it's uh, equipped with a child safety uh, socket. On the inside, let's see, first of it, this is the uh, relay switch, it's capable of 10 amps at 250 uh, volts AC and they also mark 60 amps at 250 AC, I'm not sure why they have different uh, contact rating on the relay so what do we see over here I'm not sure what it is I think it is a fuse on this side well yes I think this is a fuse in my first opinion but here you have the uh, I guess this is a Wi-Fi chip so here you have the brand name and I don't see a what is this it should be the product number so let's use this to check it what kind of information there is about it and I also noticed that as you can see over here you just have one button but actually there are two buttons available on the PCB so that would I think it is possible that this one this one is also uh, a switch, as a reset switch or something. Let's check if that is true. So if I put back the casing, you can hear it clicking, pressing this one. And this one uh, also a button. I haven't read it yet in the manual, but maybe uh, this is kind of some kind of uh, reset switch. So now I'm looking for the um, 433 megahertz uh, transceiver let's see uh, if we can find it this should be the antenna yes this is the antenna for the 433 megahertz frequency and this is the circuit over here for that uh, frequency 
let's see if I can show the other side to you as well but I see two screws I have to open first three screws come on well just pull it out and this is on the rear side of the PCB let's clean it a bit this always gets in handy to read out chips just apply a little bit on the PCB brush it a little bit Usually you can uh, get a clear view on the uh, ICs. Cannot read any information on the IC. And this one AP8012. I'm gonna close the device again. And, uh, then you have seen the insides of this part of the electronics. So well guys, so um, I will make more of this kind of uh, videos on my channel. So I still have... Uh, this is Sonoff system, maybe you've heard about it. This is also um, uh, a switching power socket that can be uh, controlled using uh, Wi-Fi. You can buy these things for around, I think, 5 euro, 6 euro including shipment to your home and uh, they also work well in the next video I will uh, open this device and I also have some more Fib Fibaro smoke sensor and lots of other electronics that I would uh, love to see the inside but also would like to show you uh, what you can find on the inside of the electronics so uh, I hope you uh, like this kind of videos please uh, as always Give me a thumbs up if you uh, like the video and I try to do my best to make more of these. So enjoy your weekend. See you. Bye bye. Closed again. See you. Bye bye.